uh, soda. <laughs> um, chips. Mm, sticky notes. Soda, chips, and sticky notes. <laughs> that old trio. Yep. Howdy, Howdy folks, folks, and welcome, welcome back to, to Rookie, Rookie Reacts to Camp Camp. Ruby Reacts to Camp Camp. No, it's Rookie. I don't know why you'd say Ruby. Only well, an idiot would say that. Only an idiot would say that. And we're up to <laughs> Season 2, Episode 12 of Camp Camp. 2. 12. 2. 12. And uh, I'm Bowden Maddox. This is my daughter, Michelle, otherwise known as Rookie. Or Ruby. <laughs> Not Ruby. I don't know why you keep saying that. You ready to watch this? Yes. Are we going to find out what that weird adventure was from the no. adventure? Adventure. I don't know why I said it that way. Yeah, I think you're having a stroke no, today. Having a stroke? A weird adventure from last okay, that episode. Was me for people who have strokes. <laughs> uh, no, man. Everybody can potentially have a stroke. It's not a special class of citizen that can have a stroke. Everybody can. Fuck, I wanted to be special. Stay healthy, folks. Yes. Spay and neuter your Get pets. Get exercise. Pets. Spay and neuter your pets. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Here we go. Can you believe it, kids? No, I can't. Nikki, it's Parents' Day. We put up flyers this time and everything. Oh, we're going to meet their parents? Oh, why did I think it was Christmas? I so guess we're going to meet their parents. Our parents are showing up here today? You betcha. We'll get to show off everything you've learned so far this summer and even take part in some fun activities together as a family. How fun is that? That is extremely dependent on which one of my parents shows up. Well, you losers enjoy your family bonding because there's no way my folks are coming. Guess I get to kick back and relax. I mean, I'll just order a pizza. Did somebody say Christmas? <laughs> Santa! Mr. Santa! Santa! Back. back? Why, I've been here the whole time, Davy. But you went to Russia. The whole time. time. Well, that's perfect, because you're just in time for Parents' Day. In time for what now? <laughs> parents' Day. We'll get to show off everything you know. But there can't be a Parents' Day, because if there's a Parents' Day, then all the parents will find out that they didn't send their kid to whatever <laughs> stupid camp they thought they sent their kid to. Oh. Davy, for the sake of Camp Campbell, you have got to cancel Parents' Day. Not uh, too late. Instant. Parents are here. Parents are here. Yeah. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> you get to uh, hear, I remember this episode, uh, parts of it. You remember, you get to hear a new person, you, one of your favorite people. He's doing a voice in here. Jeremy. Huh? Jeremy. Jeremy's already done a voice in Camp Camp. He did a, an FBI agent. Gavin. In Volume 1. Gavin? Maybe. <gasps> Who are some of your other favorite people? Trevor. Trevor? Maybe. <gasps> Fredo. He Fredo? wasn't here when this happened. You're going through all the achievement hunters, ex except the ones that you've said before are your favorites. I'm at Bragg. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> anyway, you'll, you'll recognize when you hear. <laughs> Whose bright idea was it to put together a parent's day anyway? Who do you think? Well, everything seems to be going swell so far, don't you think? And this is where we took over the camp for a while and had a huge party. Preston threw up a lot. I got cool sunglasses. Nicolette, I thought we saw one of those flower girls or something. No, Mom, that was last year, remember? I got run out by all those mean girls. It was kind of traumatic for me. Oh, sweetheart, you know I can't keep up with all your silly little adventures. <laughs> Dad! What? I thought it'd be fun. Look, we're twins. We're twins. Uh, which one's the real Neo? Huh? Huh? Oh, why couldn't Mom have come today? Ah, oh, come on, Neil. It's just us guys hanging out, being dudes. Being dudes. Don't really get rowdy, huh? Dad, can you please stop trying to connect with me and let me suffer through my poor excuse of a science camp? Well, if you're not enjoying yourself. I've still got a few dozen spots left in my summer Socrates seminar. Dad! Dad! I will consider this day a win if you promise not to bring up Socrates again. Well, I'm a professor of philosophy, Neil. It's not like I can and just... Don't say that out loud. <laughs> it's embarrassing. <laughs> Whatever you say, dude. Dude. <laughs> Nicolette, I did not shoot you out of my front butt for you to go karate <laughs> chopping strangers. My front Except butt? Apology and don't sue us. Oh, it's no problem. I've got health insurance after all. <laughs> yeah, he's Jewish. You well, that makes one of uh -oh. them. The name's Candy. Nikki's mom is hitting on Neil's Carl. father. Hey. You and your 
your dad look the same. Take it back. <laughs> That's going to be a catastrophe. See, this is why I'm grateful my parents don't show up to shit like this. Now, now, just because they're late doesn't mean they're not coming. Right, Mr. Campbell? Shut up, Davy. Mr. Campbell, allow me to introduce myself. I'm Agent Miller, and this is my partner, Agent Miller. You're playing both well, of them. Gentlemen, whatever brings you to this complete... And they're married. They're gay and married. Why? Our precious daughter, Meredith. And they're oh. Meredith's dad. I said, Dads. call me Arid. Oh, so you two are... My cool gay dad. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, thank God. You're just gay. But allow me to congratulate you on your return to United States soil, Mr. Campbell. We're not sure how you came into possession of such vital Russian intelligence, but your country thanks you. Well, I... Of course, now that you're back in the good old oh, U.S. Jesus. of A, you'll be that much easier to monitor. You're not out of the woods yet, Mr. Campbell. We're watching for any funny business. Uh-huh. Well, <laughs> if you see any funny business, be sure to point it out, because I'd be alarmed if you found any... Hey, there's some funny business going on over here. <laughs> Whoops. I signed my boy up for behavioral correction. Guess who that is. Not paints and crafts or whatever this queer shit is. <gasps> Mom, <laughs> you're being politically insensitive. Sorry, queer stuff. I mean... I guess that's better. <laughs> uh, well, you see, this is Nerfington. We yeah. Where's the LARPing? Who are all of these children? Yes, I, I need answers. Yes, 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 oh, well, they got a point. Where is the <laughs> Well, I'd say it was a good run. <laughs> you know what LARPing is? Now, I think so, role-playing. Uh, uh, like live-action role-playing? You haven't been tricked or <laughs> swindled. Camp Campbell covers all of the wonderful camps you signed your children up for. Why, we even have a song about it, which you can hear at another time. <laughs> but what makes this camp so special is that it has the heart and ambition to be all of those camps while still providing the individual attention that each child deserves. Whether it be nerd camp for... Neil? Or adventure camp right. for... Girl Neil! <laughs> and if my words aren't enough to convince you... <coughs> I'll prove it. Good, because you're gonna have to, or we're taking you in. Right. So, everyone outside, it's time to show off some Camp Campbell captivities. Have fun. Oh no, you don't. This Parents' Day needs to go off without a hitch. That means good times and happy families. What? Until this one's actual parents are <laughs> here, you three are gonna be the perfect <laughs> nuclear family. Got it? We're of course have so he loves it. Fun family. It's um nice, Naris. I'm just concerned it's not very safe. Well, when danger lurks around every corner, a mage has no time for safety. Isn't that right, Elder One? Right, Naris. Uh, but do listen to your mother. Everyone having fun? Well, good. Campy diem. Cameron Campbell. Pleasure to meet you. Lieutenant Stuart Houston, thanks for taking pity on my boy here. Um, what do you mean? But I really think I hit my stride with this piece. Greeting the sunrise. <laughs> Good morning, Mr. Sun. So, what do you think? Oh, boy, I know. He just loves art. I don't get it either. It's just so embarrassing. Really? That's... That's what you're picking up from this? Papa, we have been overseas. Papa. It is my passion. But why couldn't you be passionate for something more manly? Like guns or football? I like football. Go! Oh, right, we have to raise you on that German army base. <sighs> okay, I'm I'm piecing this together now. But your country thanks you. Um, excuse me. Oh, you must be Harrison's parents. He's quite the little magician. Uh, yes, um, we know. We were wondering. Have you figured out what's wrong with him? Excuse me? The things that he can do... They're unnatural! We were hoping this camp could help him control his abilities. Like the milk in the newspaper thing? He made his brother disappear! Hey, guys. <gasps> oh, still... Told you, I think run. he has real magic. Speaking of disappearing, where's Max? So, space kid. Can't help but notice I haven't seen any grown-ups walking around with fish bowls on their heads. Where are your parents? Oh, my parents couldn't make it. Oh, really? 
That sucks. Yeah, but my uncle came instead. He's the coolest guy in the galaxy. Oh, really? Yep. Say, could you hand me that hydraulic monkey wrench? Oh, I've been pinned! <laughs> I've been pinned. Max, your mother and I are very disappointed Jesus Christ. in your behavior. Your mother Don't and I. Make us ground you. Okay, you're definitely taking this dumb parenting role too seriously. Am I right, Gwen? Nah, for real, Max. Look what you did to Space Kid. I'll save you, Pukaru! Uncle Boris, my hero! Buzz Aldrin! I never leave a man behind, Neil. Neil? Somebody call me? Yup, Neil Armstrong Jr., named after his great-grandfather. Rocket fuel runs through his veins. <laughs> it tickles! Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> huh, guess that means we have two Neils now. Oh, hell no! <laughs> I'm putting my foot down. I'm Neil. I've been here longer than you anyway. <laughs> no, you haven't. Yeah, okay. That's but true. I'm smarter than you. <laughs> no argument here, Neil. <laughs> Say, aren't you two the ones who sent me that fake video of Neil walking on the moon? Uh, well, technically the footage is real, but we did do some alterations. I know the footage was real. It was footage of me on the moon. Okay, yeah, but we didn't think the actual Buzz Aldrin would ever see it. So when you think about it, we're victims too. <laughs> no. Lucky I'd never hit a woman. There's no greater crime than faking a moon landing. David <laughs> helped too. Max, help. Thanks for speaking up, son. It's an honor, sir. <laughs> uh, uh, time for the family dinner. <clears throat> dinner served. Ah, uh, excuse me, Bob. Your gross spoon hand just fell You don't recognize food. who that is? Mm hmm. Here. Mom, violence is not the answer. You're going to get yourself caught in an endless loop. I sure hope it's who I think it is, because it sounds just like her. Incarceration. All right, all right. Gaylord, sweetie, would you mind cutting my food for me? Oh. I'm not allowed near knives. Campbell. Oh, don't think, yes. don't think main rooster teeth are achievement hunter. Think Funhouse. I hope the cuisine oh. is up to your liking. The mashed potatoes are our quarter. Sounds like a lease. Yeah. Its mediocrity oh. is unparalleled. But we're concerned about something else. <laughs> there appears to be a wild animal gorging itself at the table next to us. Why? That's just our camp mascot. That's pretty cool. You just let that animal eat it's the table with pussies the for life. I let that thing do whatever it Remember? Wants. That was their motto. The, the one she came up with. I think she came up with it. I'm not sure. No, she didn't come up with it. She just said it. <laughs> That's just how it says hello. It's perfectly safe. Just don't let it kick you. What? So, what did you think of my one act, one man, one word play, Graham Graham? What was that, Preston? I said, what did you think of my play? Little bit louder, please. The play, woman! Did you like the play? <laughs> oh, yes. It was lovely. Thank you. Come in. <laughs> Damn it, Max. Quit being such a shit today. What are you going to do, Mom? Send me to a summer camp where you don't have to deal with me? Oh, that is an ironclad comeback. Okay, family, who's ready for dessert? Whoop. Max, I still see some peas on that plate. Is it too late to try and get adopted by one of these other families? <laughs> they all look slightly less miserable. Well, except Niels. Boy, son, you sure blew my mind with all these... What did you call them? Chemistry tubes? Beakers, Dad. They're called beakers. Well, excuse me for using the layman's term. That is the layman's term. Ah, oh, come on, son. I'm just trying to learn about your interests. Speaking of which, are you interested in any ladies around here? What? No. Oh, I bet there's someone. What about that little green-haired friend of yours? <laughs> Nikki. What was her name? Girl Neil? Girl, Girl Neil. Nicolette, actually. My little angel. You gonna eat that? <laughs> so, Carl, I hear you're some sort of big shot professor. I love a man with money. Money? Intelligence. Oh, well, yes, I do teach philosophy. Wow. Are you tenured? Our parents <laughs> sure are talking a lot. <gasps> Ooh, do you think they like like each other? Huh? <gasps> Maybe they'll get married. I've always wanted an older brother. Dibs on top, Bunk. <laughs> Not if I can help it. Yeah, Neil's not going to sit hey, for that. Dad, you know what 
would impress everybody if you told us all about the Socratic method. Oh boy. Well, if I'm gonna do that, I'm gonna need my teaching assistant. Socrates. Socrates? Socrates! The world's greatest philosopher and gym sock! I stink! Therefore I am! I know that's actually Descartes. I just couldn't think of another sock-related pun. <laughs> Your dad blamed. Oh, I'm <laughs> counting on it. Oh, Carl. You never told me you were so good with your hands. Oh, Jesus. Oh, for fuck's, oh, sake. <laughs> for fuck's sake. I wasn't done eating that. You didn't need the calories. Oh. Oh. Max, you know, you are really pushing my <laughs> patience today. I have half a mind to tell your parents about this when they get here. How are you not getting this? My parents don't care about shit like this. They are not coming ever. Uh. Uh oh. Hey oh. everybody. It's Jeremy's. We're Mr. and Mrs. Farts. <laughs> <laughs> Have any of you seen our beautiful boy, Jeremy? Oh, uh, uh we kind of lost him in a bit of sold him camp across the lake. Is this some sort of joke? Is this some sort of joke? He was really gross. Time for our final activity! Everybody out! <laughs> for the record, <laughs> we completely understand. <laughs> Boy, have we had some fun. But sadly, it's time we ended Parents' Day by having our campers show you all what they've learned here at Camp Campbell to a degree that will surely legitimize the legality of this camp. Let's start with Magic Boy. Um, okay. Okay. Come on up, <laughs> Mom and Dad, and watch me as I saw one of you in half. <laughs> Davy, you never let me down <clears throat> as far as I can remember. And I know you never would, which is why I need you to make sure every single snot nosed kid out there shows off whatever it is their parents sign them up for. It's either that, or I'm heading to Super Guantanamo. I've never heard of Super Guantanamo. No. Consider yourself lucky. It's Super Guanta Guantanamo. Okay, family, you heard the man. We've got to show off whatever it is Max was saying. What By the way, I think this is the season finale. Anyway. It I'll double matter, check. Because there's no way the other losers don't blow this thing first. Check it. So you see, Mom, sometimes words cut deeper than knives. <laughs> I wish I'd known that yeah. before I'd gone to prison. That's at least. Thank you, son. <laughs> the hell? <laughs> that was borderline heartwarming. That's enough, Max. It's time we worked on our super fun routine. Hold on. The next one will be a train wreck for sure. Do you hear it, Elder One? The drums in the deep. Surely, they'd be the footsteps of the Dragon Queen! Roar. <laughs> Gas. What should we do, Nerys the Cute? I cast! This is like you and me Hug with Ruby it. and Mom. Who has no interest in it. Aw, okay. I guess you could say it's super. Or Rooster Teeth active. and Mom. Well, no, that's Pokemon. But I love you for trying. <laughs> Aww. Yes! Ah, no! Come on, Max. This is important. This is stupid! Well, everyone else is having fun, and you will too once Gwen gets back with your enrollment paperwork. We'll be a happy little family, I promise. Enrollment paperwork. Huh. Yeah, they're trying to figure out why he went to camp for. Oh. I was just thinking the same thing about our parents. I missed our that, parents. sorry. <laughs> Wait, I thought they were with you. I thought they were with you. Well, no, they're I fucking. I think they're having sex. And now, Preston Goodplay. Why, hello, grandmother. Oh, they are. <laughs> Pardon? They're in the house. Oh. Hey. Uh, <laughs> Awkward. Hey, Neil. <laughs> don't let him pin you, Mom. Take on the belt. <laughs> Holy fucking parents. I don't want to see my Literally. dad again. Nah, Neil, look. He's still wearing Socrates. Whoopsie daisy. <laughs> I love daisies. I love daisies. You might want to get yourself tested for quarter sister. <laughs> yes, sir. This is for quarter sister. Sense. You, the girl, and that boy on stage now. I'm counting on you. But we don't. Um, I have the utmost faith in you, Ricardo. I need that chopper ready. Remember, he was so proud that they named a venereal disease after his sister, the quarter master, was. David. 
Never mind. I found Max's papers. Great! We can do this! I don't want to do this! Max, that is it! I am fed up with your bad attitude. Why do you hmm. always have to bring everyone else down instead of trying just a little bit to have fun? David, now it's all uh -oh. on a happy face. Go out there and show everyone just how great you are at... Um, wait. I told you, I didn't care. Aww. Just make something up so we can get this over with. Max, I... I didn't know. And now, for our final and most important performance... Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for Davy, Gladys, and Gladys. <laughs> what the what? Oh, don't tell me I lost another kid. Oh, okay, that might sound incriminating, but Bye. Why are we here? What about Campbell's big show? That's stupid. What? You were right. It's stupid. You shouldn't have to pretend for anyone. Are you... okay? I'm... sorry, Max. I try to always see the good in things. And I try to get others to see the same. But pretending like things are okay when they're not doesn't help anything. I'm sorry your parents don't care enough, Max. You have every right to be angry. But you deserve to be happy. And I hope you can find that here at camp. Even if it's not today. Life sucks sometimes. But at least there's pizza. Yeah, there you go. Well, don't just look at it. Eat up, you little shit. <laughs> I'll go make sure the car starts. David? Mm-hmm. Aw. That never happened. <laughs> okay, Max. Seriously, I will murder you if it gets back to the game. <laughs> You think everything's in okay back at the camp? No, oh, I'm sure it's nothing Mr. Campbell couldn't handle. You bastards! <laughs> you goddamn bastards! Do you know who I am? I am Cameron C. Campbell! I'm richer than all of you combined! I was the Prime Minister of Thailand! Meredith seems to be enjoying this. Tell it to your cellmates in <clears throat> Super Guantanamo. This is all your fault, Davy! I swear on my minor league baseball teams, you haven't heard the last of me! Yeah, that's our camp. One backstab could put me on my ass, so I was scout. Okay. Is that what you thought of it? So I believe that was the finale, season finale. There you go, there are the voices. Volume 2. Let's see if we were right. What would her name have been? Well, you just look for her real name. <laughs> I know, but I'm just trying to make sure the character as well. Anyway, it'll be further on down the line. <clears throat> Let's see. Miss Pris, and here we go. Yep. Elise Wilms, yep. Definitely sounded like her. Oh, and Becca Fraser, too. And Jen Brown. John Reisinger. Miles was Lawrence. Mr. Farts. Lawrence. Miles was Mr. Farts. Mr. Farts, yeah. All right, so what do you think of that episode, and what do you think of the whole season? I don't remember the other ones, but this one was funny. This one was really funny. Yeah. Let me confirm that that really was season finale. I believe it was. Ugh. We will go over real fast, and we will look at uh, and this, this right here, and this is this is this is. Um, two, eleven, twelve, yeah. That's it. By the way, there's two episodes of season three that have aired. The final two episodes of season three, I never did see. So those will be blind when we get to them. I've been uh, marking that I need to watch those with you. So, <clears throat> you thought the whole season was pretty funny? Mm -hmm. uh, any favorite episode of the season stand out to you? I don't remember any of you them. You can't remember them? I can't really remember them either. I remember that season two started out a little... Uh, Dry. Well, I, I didn't think it was very very funny. This is the one that also had, I think, the one with the cult leader, I think. Was in this one? Remember where they, the alternate version of of of, da of David that led the, the cult leader? Remember in all white? Remember yes. him? Yeah. I think that was in this one, too. 
<clears throat> as you can see from the, the stars, um, when you back up, they list them in the order they appeared in the season. And you see that we have Quartermaster, Quarter Sister appeared in this one. Remember, that was the joke where he said, you get you sh uh, where Neil's mother told, or, I'm sorry, not Neil's mother, uh, um, Nikki's mother told go. Neil's father, you should get yourself checked for Quarter Sister. Because <clears throat> remember when Quarter Sister appeared up, Quartermaster was proud that, or not, I don't know if he was proud, but he said that they even named a venereal disease after her, after his sister. That's funny. Um, <clears throat> All right. Pardon me, guys. So this is also the one that had Jeremy Farts, obviously. And Jasper, the, the ghost on the island. Mm -hmm. Right? Bonquisha. Bonquisha. I don't know if... Was she in the first season as well and reappeared in the second season? I don't know. I don't remember. <clears throat> that she was here. Um, is this the one where they went to town as well? No, that was later. I don't know. Anyway, I give up. Um, I can't really pick a favorites either, uh, although I love the, the parents episode, the one we just saw. With all the parents. I think that's probably my favorite of the season, I've got to say. That's funny. It was a really funny episode. And you got all your favorites have had voices in here now. Gavin didn't. Not Gavin. And and not Jeff. Jeff only does voices in... Trevor. In Red vs. Blue, apparently. Afraid you do. Else. Afraid you do. These aren't all your favorites. Unless you're saying everybody in Achievement Hunter is not your favorite. Everybody in Achievement Hunter right there. Jack. Okay. Jack has not, I don't think, had a voice. Maybe he has. Not this season. He's not listed, so. All right. Matt Holm. Wow. Oh. The, uh, oh, my God. The little Hitler's father was apparently Matt Holm. That's oh. awesome. I didn't even catch that. Yeah. And Jen Brown, Graham Graham. Ah. <laughs> anyway, guys, I think that's going to do it. Uh, for our camp camp, we will get back to season three pretty soon, probably after Ruby is finished, or Ruby Chibi is finished, or something like that. Thanks for watching. Bye. Catch you next time. Catch you next time.